Hi, I'm going to show you the new Espresso range that we have just received. Uh, this is the Espresso Deluxe. We have also the Espresso Style. The Espresso Style does not have the, the metal warming plate as well as the metal drip tray. Other than that, they are the same. The new machine has a new filter holder. It's a 53 millimeter filter holder and it comes with two baskets. Both are per, per, crema perfetta baskets. That means that you have got lots of holes inside and there's only one hole outside which produces a nice crema. And you don't have any other mechanisms in so the, the filter holder itself is not pressurized as it was on the Carezza and the uh, Grand models or Viva models. So here you just have the perfect the crema for perfetta or we call it the perfect crema basket. You just insert that and you just can use a uh, finely ground coffee or even it will be okay for slightly coarser grinds. The finer the better it is. You can use the single basket for the single shot of espresso or you can mainly these use for uh, ESC pods. So you have that and it has got a little rubber piece which actually goes on top of the uh, espresso pods which makes it nice and even when you're brewing so that's something new on this range you have got a, a nice tank that comes out sideways and you can fill it in situ or you can take it out uh, you have got the three buttons the on this model we have, or both models I should say, the Espresso Deluxe and the Espresso Style, you can have a memo function. So that means that you can actually have a pre-portioned espresso uh, programmed on that button. So you have the ability to measure your shot uh, and you can program it and you can reprogram it. Uh, and you can delete that program if you wanted to. The frother is exactly the same as you have on the Grand Gadget and the Viva and the Carezza, uh, but they have slightly uh, changed the way it articulates. So you have the, you are able to bring it forward away from the machine, so you can actually put a, a jug fairly easily there. You can take that part off and froth it without it and to get a flat white and that kind of uh, creamy uh, sort of a textured milk I would normally take that part off and froth it so you have got a fair space there. Um, the machine comes with a PID and that produces a very uh, precise uh, temperature for your espresso. You also have a pre-infusion system on this one so you can actually when you press the button it will spray some water into the coffee to infuse it and allow about two seconds and then it will uh, infuse again or send water through again so that gives you a nice creamy coffee so it's a fairly straightforward machine and it's quite heavy as well the handle has been uh, reinforced with uh, some weight as well so it is quite nice and e uh, nice to handle uh, you don't get a traditional basket so you only get the perfect crema baskets but you can use a 53 millimeter traditional basket so if the one that I'm showing you now has got lots of holes that you can see through so if you wanted to make it a traditional machine you don't need another handle uh, you can just take the a perfect crema basket out and put that one in and you have got a traditional system so it's quite a versatile machine for the basic entry-level machine so it is really good for the people who are starting off uh, their coffee experience 
and it has got a very powerful boiler 1900 watt boiler a 1900 watt boiler uh, it is a thermoblock like the one that you get on the Karetsa which means that you can actually get a very quick temperature to the you know to get the the coffee temperature it is very quick and also for steam it has got a pulsating pump that means that you can carry on uh, frothing the milk or steaming the milk for a long period of time as long as you have got water in the tank uh, unlike uh, hollow boilers here you are heating tiny bits of water uh, and pumping that through and it is therefore quite uh, a very regular kind of steam that comes through uh, and can last for a long time so there are some really nice uh, features on this machine for an entry-level machine and I think you can make a really good espresso from this so hopefully we will have more videos how to use it but it is very similar to the other machine so if you wanted to watch the videos of other models making an espresso is exactly the same uh, but you have got the perfect crema basket uh, both for the single and the double so I hope you can try that and um, if you wanted to find out more about it go to our website you can also come on zoom and talk to us and we can give you a one-to-one -one demonstration as well so thank you for watching